Lacrosse has indigenous or origins in North America, but the game has been more prominent in regionalized areas with less cultural diversity. The Black Star Lacrosse Club here in Los Angeles is trying to change that. The club teaches and promotes the sport to black and brown communities in underserved areas in L.A. I caught up with the lacrosse club as they make the game more diverse, one goal at a time. Just use your wrist to like bend. Yeah, you got it. Now okay. walk. Now walk and cradle. Boom. You yes. got it. Can I, can I run? Yeah, you can run. You got it. Shoulder, shoulder, shoulder. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> that was pretty good. That was pretty good. I started this program because I personally wanted to change the game. And the only way that I know I can change the game is by changing how the game is played, but also about by who's playing it. When I look around, there are a lot of people who look like you and I. Yes. Is that one part of the reason why this is, why you wanted to do this? Yes, so I wanted to create space for black and brown, you know, young athletes, you know, families to be able to play lacrosse and feel comfortable, you know, expressing their culture, expressing themselves. When you look at the landscape of lacrosse, there's not a lot of diversity being encouraged. So I really want to emphasize the roots of the game. I want the kids to understand where the game came from, and I want them to understand there's always a place for them to play in this game. Anybody can play lacrosse. What kind of influence is the game of lacrosse having on these kids? Oh, it's having a great influence. They're getting the opportunity to play a game that they've never played before. You know, uh, football, soccer, baseball, you know, tennis, those are all great sports, but you know, I wanted to share something that a lot of kids in this area didn't have the opportunity to play or didn't know about. Hey, you got this, man. You got this. Yes, 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 yes. What, what's your favorite thing to do out here when, you, when you're out here practicing? Just run out there and do what I do. What, what, what do you do? I just try to play my hardest in the practice and the games. I give it my all. With my teammates, I get to learn that uh, I can improve every day. My footwork just gets better. And for my coaches, they just uh, push me to improve and they teach me how to do stuff so I could just get better and so I could score my goals. I'm from Florida where the game of lacrosse is really popular, but people who look like me don't really play it. And so to come out here to California, like all the way across the country, and see like this really diverse community of people playing lacrosse is absolutely amazing to me. Is she the hardest hitter on the team? Yes, yes, yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. yes. How, mu how much do you guys love playing this sport? 100%. million, 100%. 200%. 2,000%. This is a very unique opportunity for kids in Los Angeles, uh, families in Los Angeles, to experience the game of lacrosse. You know, especially in the Inglewood area where, you know, I think we are the first lacrosse team that's ever been here. And, you know, with us hosting the Los Angeles, you know, 2028 Olympics and lacrosse being named an Olympic sport, this is a huge opportunity for us to really champion the game and champion our area before the Olympics gets here. We want to make sure that we bring in the game the right way and we want to make sure that, you know, we come correct. Can I keep it real? You're a coach who started this to give this an opportunity for other people who look like me. Can you coach me? I've never, I've never, I've never learned the sport. Is there something that you can teach me oh, right I, now? Oh, I can definitely teach you something give right me, now. Just, just put me through a drill. I'll put you drill. through a drill. Okay. okay, I got you. Come over here. What you got to do is you got to scoop through. I got that. Right, and yep. you got to cradle. Cradle, I got that. And then shoot it to the goal. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so oh, stick by, oh, stick by. Ooh, I like that, stick by. Appreciate you guys. All right, so time for my last call. Let, let's talk more about the Black Star Lacrosse Club. Like, real talk, I, I grew up around lacrosse. But as soon as I arrived to do this story, you guys, I mean, I was absolutely blown away. Not because of how talented these kids were, but because most of the kids look like me. I've never seen that before. Lacrosse is still a predominantly white sport, so if someone told me there was a black lacrosse club, I wouldn't believe them. What the Black Star Lacrosse Club is doing in L.A. is turning what was a lack of opportunity for me into an equal opportunity for everyone else. That's my last call.